This is our second year with the Exact Emerge technology on the farm. We run both a corn planter and a soybean planter, Exact Emerge. The uh, 16 row machine behind us planted all of our corn this year. We did a lot of eight mile an hour on fields this year. Uh, we, we run uh, fertilizer with it, so we, we're kind of limited to that seven and a half, eight mile an hour for several reasons. But uh, second year, corn stands are all looking good. Uh, very pleased with the technology. Excellent uh, singulation. We can really cover a lot of acres in a day. You were happy with the results last year, but this year was more comfortable to you there in the cab to go that fast. Yeah, year number two is uh, just a, like you said, it's a lot more comfortable. We, we knew the crop was going to come up if we, if we did everything right. Um, last year was the learning year. You know, we essentially were planting across the field at what we used to turn on the ends, uh, you know, five and a half mile an hour. So that six to eight mile an hour range uh, really was different for us. So this year we started out a little more comfortable and again, just rolled right through and we had those opportunities to get in the field. We have a great partnership with JD Equipment here in London and it uh, works out well for both of us. They provide the uh, equipment needs here at the Farm Science Review so we know how sensitive those planting dates are for us when we're trying to have a crop ready to harvest for the demonstrations in September. So planting date is critical for us and with those small windows we've got to do everything we can. Um, like everybody in the area we, uh, we were able to start early around April 19th and we only had a couple days at a time there and uh, having that technology in front of us was a, a great asset this year. We really want people to notice the advantages that this planter has over anything else in the industry. So with a seed delivery system, dropping the seed two inches from the bottom of the seed trench, we don't sacrifice any accuracy. Maybe the field conditions aren't the best. We can take a smaller planter, travel a little bit faster, and, uh, and compensate, you know, instead of having a big 60 or 80 foot planter running around, planting beans we can take a 40 foot planter and achieve the same productivity. Not to mention spacing and singulation are bar none compared to any other options that we have. It's electric drive, no more chains and sprockets, hydraulic motors to run, it's just simply electric.